Splinters come in all shapes and sizes and can be quite painful. To reduce pain and prevent infection, splinters should be removed as soon as you notice them. To remove a splinter, follow these tips from dermatologists. To prevent infection, wash your hands and the affected area with soap and water and pat your skin dry. Inspect the splinter. If it's very small, use a magnifying glass to see how big the splinter is and which direction it entered the skin. If part of the splinter is sticking out, use tweezers to gently pull out the splinter. First, sterilize the tip of the tweezers using rubbing alcohol. Then, pull out the splinter in the same direction that it entered the skin. Never squeeze out a splinter, as this may cause it to break into smaller pieces that are harder to remove. If the entire splinter is embedded under the skin, use a small needle to remove it. Sterilize the needle and a pair of tweezers using rubbing alcohol. Afterwards, look through a magnifying glass and use the needle to gently pierce the surface of the skin at one end of the splinter. Continue to use the needle to carefully push out part of the splinter. Once one end of the splinter is sticking out, use the tweezers to gently pull out the splinter. After the splinter has been removed, Clean the area with soap and water and apply petroleum jelly. Keep the area covered with a bandage until it heals. Most splinters can be safely removed at home, but some may require medical assistance. See your doctor or a board-certified dermatologist if your splinter is very large, deep, located in or near your eye, or if the area becomes infected. To find a dermatologist in your area, visit AAD.org.